in time to celebrate a birthday. Is it mine? Is it Brayden's birthday? That means it's mine too. Oh right, you're twins. Is it your birthday? Is it my birthday? It's my birthday. The flag's birthday? What would make you think that? This is flag day, the day that the flag was born. Flag day, the day the flag was born. So let's sing happy birthday. Are you ready? Well, it's not a, it's not a birthday without cupcakes. Should we have cupcakes for our flag? Yeah. Okay, here we go. And here we go. Let me light those. Ready? One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear the flag. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, flag. Woo! All right. We're going to eat our cupcakes, then we're going to start our flag day celebration. How old is the flag? Oh. Mm. How old is the flag? Do you know? Mm. This year, the flag is. 242 years old. Are you one? Are you two? Are, oh, that's, no, 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 that's not gonna work out so well. That's gonna take a while. <laughs> so now that we know that Flag Day celebrates the day that the flag was born when we got our stars and stripes, let's try to learn about the stars and the stripes. How many stripes do we have? Count with me, ready? Oh, whoa, you know that already? Okay, let's double check. They think it's 13. You guys think it's 13? Let's see, count with me. remember this. What do you think? Okay. Okay, let me go get it. We are set up. Arts and crafts always helps reinforce what we just learned. Right guys? Mm -hmm. Now this is really cool. Each of you take a clothespin and a cotton ball. Oh, I know this. Stick it on the end. Good. Get it right in there so some of the puffiness is sticking out. Now this becomes your paintbrush. Okay? And you're gonna dip it in a color and then put dots of it on your paper. Your goal is to make an American flag. You can paint with it, you can put dots with it, however you want to make it end up looking like an American flag. Right, you can use the whole paper and make it big. You can do it however you want. This is your project. The important thing that you, they're learning in this craft is the stars and the stripes, right? Because they represent things about our country. They're symbols of our country. Is it the 49 nifty United States? No. Why not? Because we don't have 49. Who was the last one to join us? Hawaii. Hawaii. Which one? Hawaii. Hawaii. Yes, Hawaii was our 50th state. Aloha to everyone in Hawaii. I miss you. This looks so good. Hold on. Nice job, Caleb. This is so good. Check it out. You got your red and white stripes, right? And you have the blue with the white stars on top. Nicely done. Now this is really cool because if you don't have all of these supplies at home, you can use anything really. You can use construction paper, you can use paint brushes if you don't want to do it this way, crayons, markers, it doesn't matter. The point is just that the kids are learning that our flag has stars and stripes. Awesome, Bray. I and even made a stick. Nice. Right? And the important part is that the stripes are for the what, you guys? Fifteen original colonies. And the stars are for the? Fifteen nifty United States. Yes, that's what we're going for. Do you guys think that the flag always looked like this flag? No. No? What do you mean? It looks like a different. Like back when? It was first born in 1777. Yeah. It looked different? Oh, yeah. oh, 
there's one over there. Could you get it? <laughs> He's right. This is what it used to look like. What's the difference here, you guys? Yeah, it had a sugar. Does it have 50 stars on here? No. No, let's count how many it has. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen? For the what? Thirteen original colonies. It's thirteen stripes. And thirteen stripes. Um, but then we added some states, right? And now our flag looks like this. So maybe we should do an activity that shows us what our old flag looked like. Guys, do you want to make the original flag from 1777 out of M&M's? Yeah! Let's go! All right, let me clean this up, and we're gonna get some M&M's out here. We'll be right back, you guys. Da -da -da -da! The point of this activity, not only to remember what the original flag looked like, but the importance of the colors on the flag. The colors represent certain things also. What color is this? Red. Red, very good. Red in the flag represented valor or courage. Go ahead, have some courage. Have some courage. <laughs> I'd like some courage too, please. These are good. It's a lot of courage. Uh, save some for the flag, man. Okay, okay. All right, let me put the valor or courage down. Our next color is what? White. 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 The white in our flag represents purity or innocence. Have some purity and innocence. Just like one or two, please. Purity and innocence. What color do we have here? Blue. 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 The blue in the American flag represents justice. Would you like one, one piece of justice? Like the Justice League? Like the Justice League? Justice, like fairness, right? All right, so I'm gonna give you guys each a little placemat here. So this is gonna be what you use to make your flag on. And you have a little example up top of what we want it to look like. All right, guys, go ahead, and you can design these in the shape of that flag right there. These are coming out amazing. So if you're doing this at home, remember the point of this activity is to just show the significance of each color, right? The color- And also eat them. And also eat them. The colors and the shapes on flags are significant. They're symbols. They represent things about each country. So the takeaway from this is the importance of the colors. You don't have to do M&Ms. You can use anything. You can use bits of paper, construction paper. You can use buttons. You can use anything that you have around the house, right? Even markers. You can use markers, right? But the point is that the colors symbolize different things for each country. Hey guys, do you know who they think might have sewn the very first flag? Betsy Ross. Betsy Ross. Huh. I'm all done. That looks amazing, Caleb. I see stars and stripes and red, white, and blue and all the symbols that make our American flag. I'm done. Wait, are you done? We have stars and stripes and all the things, you guys, that make the American flag. This is so good. Can we eat it now? We can't eat the whole flag, because that's a lot. But we can eat a few. But you know what you guys didn't know? The people who study history, the cult historians, they are starting to think that maybe it wasn't Betsy Ross. Some people think it was this guy named Francis Hopkinson. So some people think Francis Hopkinson. Some people think Betsy Ross. What do you guys think? Betsy Ross. Betsy Ross. We're team Betsy Ross over here. Thanks for hanging out with us here at BK Playhouse while we learned about all the importance of the stars and the stripes and the red, white, and blue. The boys really wanted to do a special ending and they want to sing what song? 50 Nettie Now here's the important part, you guys. Make sure you're listening carefully. If you hear your state, you have to subscribe. And if you've already subscribed, then just give us a like when you hear your state. And only if you hear your state. Are you ready? Uh -huh. Alabama, Alaska, Arizona, Arkansas, California, Colorado, Connecticut, Delaware, Florida, Georgia, Hawaii, Idaho, Illinois, Indiana, Iowa, Kansas, Kentucky, Louisiana, Maryland, Massachusetts, Michigan, Minnesota, Mississippi, Missouri, Montana, 
Nebraska, Nevada, New Hampshire, New Jersey, New Mexico, New York, North Carolina, North Dakota, Ohio, Oklahoma, Oregon, Pennsylvania, Rhode Island, South Carolina, South Dakota, Tennessee, Texas, Utah, Vermont, Virginia, Washington, West Virginia, Wisconsin, by Wyoming. If you heard your state, click subscribe. Great grandma. Great grandma, he just called you out. Did you hear your state great grandma? Who else do you want to call out? Ely Kai. Ely Kai, give us a like. <laughs> Who else? That's enough people. That's and enough. We're done. Bye. Bye guys. If it's your birthday, we're on Friday, you can make your birthday all about flag. Oh my gosh, if you're out there and your birthday's on June 14th, you share a birthday with our flag?